Now one last thing I do want to show you, and that is a hidden secret. There are some features you're not seeing in iMovie unless you know to go to this place and turn on advanced features. They're not that advanced, but let me show you. You go to the iMovie window, go to pre I mean, menu, go to preferences, and over here <clears throat> you see a little box that's not checked, advanced tools. There's a bunch of other things in here you may want to look at too. You're certainly welcome to. And when you click advanced tools, I don't know if you saw this, but I'm going to do it again. There's new buttons that show up down here. I'm going to turn that off. Whoop, they disappear. Click on it, they show up again. So there's some key things that you get that you normally wouldn't see. So I'm going to close that out because what I want to show you is a neat little feature where you can put a picture over top of another picture. All right? So let me show you. Let's say up here in my event, I wanted uh, this little moon thing to be in the corner of this video clip down here. Well, I can select that clip, drag it down, and when I bring it over here and I, and I drag it on top of the clip, and when I let go, not in between, but on top, I get a little box, a, a, a menu of things to do. And I can replace the video that's there, I can replace uh, from the beginning, I can say only add the audio. So if I only want the audio from this clip to be added into that video, that's a great way to add the audio from another clip over top of some pictures or other footage that you have. You can also do a picture in picture. And when I do picture in a picture, what I now have is this little video clip over top of my other clip. Let me show you. Let me pull the playhead over here and show you. Watch up here if it plays. It has had water on it at some time. Interacting there it is. With it. There and it is. We see and huge, uh, that's the end of my clip. So what I got to do is right there's my clip. I can drag this out to make it bigger if I want or put it in the bottom right hand corner. So if you wanted something in the corner like the, if I want to have an interview with somebody and I wanted to show them in the corner while I showed the footage, the really fancy footage of Mars, I could do that. You can also still apply effects to this clip. You click on that little crop button and you can uh, adjust this a little bit, pull it out. and. Like, I don't want to see this little stuff there. Slide that over. And I could, hey, you know what? I, I could do a Ken Burns effect too. Kind of create some really dizzying effects here. Let's start from here and see what we get. Let's hit play. I'm interacting with it. Ooh, oh, it's like we're coming in at an angle. Job. Oh, that's kind of cool. It's like we're really flying into it. That was actually a good effect. Sometimes I don't get so lucky. Uh, so you can do that again. So play with these things. Click done. You know, experiment. You can't hurt anything. You know, it's just see what will happen. That picture over a picture is a nice little feature that uh, might come in really handy to you. I showed you a little bit about how to adjust a little bit about audio with ducking and stuff. I'm going to show you even more with audio, like how to add that music I was talking about in my next video. Mm -hmm.